Morning guys, welcome back to another one. Nate and I are out trying for the turkeys one more time. Let's see what happens. All right guys, so we got here a little earlier than last time. It was still dark when we come in. We could hear him gobbling from the truck. So we got set up where we saw him last time. Started calling. And two of them came, two toms came from my right. And I couldn't see him, I was obstructed by a tree. As I poke my head around a tree, they look at me. So here they are about 20 yards, looking, trying to figure out what the heck I am. So they just started to walk away, which, tells me they weren't exactly uh, concerned. So I hope the GoPro picked it up. I then moved from the tree, tried to cut them off at the top end of the, of the ravine. I'll show you what we're working with here. All right, so Nate and I were up in here. As you see, it comes down a level, then down a level again, and it goes down a level again. They were on this level here, over in that area there to my right. So as I creeped along the top, I went to the back of that blue van. I'm hoping the GoPro caught it. As I approached the top of the hill, all I could see was his head and a little bit of beard. And I'm looking at him before they took off. I know he had a good sized beard on him. So I could see his head. I took the shot. He jumped to the left. 
and I see him, him down another level, which I think is the same bird, was down another level on the bottom, and he started to run behind a car. I shot again, and uh, now we can't find the bird. So, I might have missed. In fact, it's kind of looking like I missed. So it's still early, so what we're going to do is Nate and I are going to set up down here near the river. And uh, we're going to let things settle down for a little bit, and then we're going to start calling again. The reason we're doing that is there is a ton of turkeys down here. No shortage of turkeys at all. Now, is this the same group we were watching last week? I don't know. But one thing I've told you before, when I go fishing and I don't catch anything, I show you that I don't catch anything. We don't get anything today. I'm going to show you that we don't get anything. I mean, it's just a matter of the way it is. When you're hunting or fishing, sometimes you win, sometimes you don't. We almost won. We almost won, yeah. I, I don't know if my shot pattern was off. I was shooting through a little bit of brush, but not much. So, I'm not quite sure what happened. But we're going to wait it out a little while longer, and uh, hopefully something else comes in, and we'll get a shot at it then. All right, guys, so just kind of give you a little context as to where we are at. We've got about 15 acres of lowland down here. So our range that we got set up is back in over here. The truck is back over there. But this goes all the way along. And the Thames River runs all the way from where you see me fishing near the mouth of Lake St. Clair. All the way down and runs all the way to London. The river's probably about 45, 50 yards behind us. So the toms made their way over to here. Okay, so the tom made his way right over here. I was standing. Right up there. Behind that blue van. So, as you can see, I had a little bit of brush to get through, but not much. I had a clear shot of his head and could see part of his beard. I took the shot. He then bounced over this way, went down another level. And I saw him running across here towards this car, and I shot just before the car. I swear that I seen him drop. We've searched this entire area, cannot find him. We just sat up for a little while longer, trying to call some more. They're gone. But we're gonna look around here a little more just, just to double check. So we don't wanna leave a dead bird out here. So we're gonna double check, triple check. This will be our fourth time checking. <laughs> I don't know. We're gonna keep looking. All right, so that's gonna be it for turkey hunt day two. And before you all lose your mind, I know. More camel, stay still, get there, I know. I'm trying to do a spot and stock. Yes, it hasn't worked so far, but it will. Stick with me. This is an ongoing saga. It's the Turkey 2, us nothing. We're about to even up the score here next time. So if you haven't already done so, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, like button, share button, all them buttons. We appreciate you being around. If you're new here, please hit the buttons. We'd like to have you. And by the way, I did miss the bird after watching the footage when I did the edit. I missed. And like I said before, all the hunting, fishing videos that I do, whether I catch stuff or I don't catch stuff, you get to see it because we're not hunting inside 10 foot tall fences. I don't need to get in on that rant either. So anyway, that's all I got for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. So get out there and have fun in the outdoors and I'll see you all in the next one. Later. So I'm sure all you professional turkey hunters out there are going, what in the world is this moron doing?